One of the big stories over the weekend was the confirmation that David Nofaluma will finish the season at the Melbourne Storm. Of course, the Storm are battling a major injury crisis at this stage. Uh, all of Remus Smith, George Jennings and Ryan Pappenhausen are out for the season. Looks like Nick Meany could join them for a couple of weeks given his ugly shoulder injury against the Warriors in that win, that, that lost streak, or losing streak breaking win, in fact, uh, on Friday night in Auckland. Uh, it was hardly convincing from the Storm. I think 24-12, to 12, the final scoreline there. Uh, but this is a club uh, who, you know, should be pushing for premiership uh, honours again this year under Craig Bellamy. They've really fallen away in recent times due to injury, and it has put a dent in their depth, undoubtedly. Last year, they probably had the players to cover that, but with a couple of exits uh, at the, end of, at the end of the season, of course, um, replacing Pappenhausen in particular has been a nightmare for the Storm. Uh, but Nofaluma comes into this club as an experienced winger. He's played almost 180 NRL games at the Tigers. Uh, he is a, a proven try scorer, and defensively, he's improved his game out of sight in the last couple of years. As much as there's been a lot of criticism around this uh, loan system being allowed for such a move where a, a top reigning uh, premiership contender are able to sign a player uh, from a bottom club in this instance. You have to remember, Nofaluma is actually out of the Tigers' first grade so uh, setup at the moment. He hasn't played in a number of weeks and seems to be struggling to break, break into Brett Kamali's side. And so that all said, uh, you know, I really don't have a problem with this loan uh, being allowed to proceed. And I think Nofaluma could be really, really dangerous at, the at a club like the Storm, playing outside players like Cam Munster, Jerome Hughes, uh, and, and of course, Harry Grant, I think you know he could score a lot of tries in the last couple of weeks of this season and moving into the finals where, as I said, the Storm desperately needed an outside back. They've got one. Uh, it's going to be interesting to see if they can turn their season around on the back of that.